What's up guys, Manish here and welcome to another exciting video tutorial. In this video, we'll be taking a look at some of the finest genome shell extensions. Alright, so it's been a while since genome has released the so-called extension side, which is basically still in its early stage. But having said that, uh, it contains tons of extensions that can be used to add more features onto your genome shell environment. So I've just picked out some of the extensions from that side and this video will be related to those extensions so before i start off with the video on a side note all the links related to this video will be in the description please check them out so um so let's start with the video shall we the first extension which i'm going to talk about is the music integration extension all right so the rule of thumb is that if in case you want to add any sort of extension all you got to do is you need to visit this website and then just turn on this uh, extension. So I've just turned on the music integration extension. What this extension basically does is that it adds the, uh, or it integrates the music which you're playing over here. So let me just uh, play a, a song to demonstrate this extension. As you can see over here, the music automatically gets integrated. So that's about it for the music integration extension. The next extension which I'm going to talk about is the remove accessibility icon from the uh, panel. So if in case you are not using this uh, icon or feature, you can easily disable it by uh, visiting this website and just turning on the feature. As you can see over here, the icon automatically gets disabled. And the next uh, extension which I'm going to talk about is the auto hide top panel extension. So uh, as the name suggests, it hides the uh, top panel. So if in case you activate this extension, the top panel gets hidden. The next extension is the trash icon extension, all right? So if in case you want to add the trash icon right over here, all you got to do is you need to visit this website and just turn on the feature. So the trash icon gets automatically placed. Uh, one thing you got to remember is that if the trash is empty, this icon will not appear. And the next, extension is the shutdown by default uh, many of us feel that you know the genome misses a power off or the shutdown option over here so uh, all you got to do is you need to manually uh, add that feature by um, turning on the extension here so now as you can see over here the power off option gets automatically integrated over here the next option or the extension is the binary clock extension all right so this extension shows a binary clock instead of the default one so if you turn it on you get a binary display of the clock please don't leave a comment on how to read the values because even i'm clueless on that so just turn it off and off slippery move clock basically moves the clock onto the right hand side and the slippery bot panel uh, if you turn on this extension, you'll note that a panel has been placed right at the bottom. Yes, I do agree that it looks ugly, but it is extremely helpful when you have got large number of windows uh, turned on and you want to switch between them very frequently. So um, those are some of the extensions uh, which are pretty cool. You can find some more uh, extension in the website that is extension.genome.org uh and that's about it guys please do rate and subscribe and uh, leave a comment if you've got any queries and uh like our fan page for regular updates take care